thousands of medical students around the country and the world, the donning of the white coat is the singular rite of passage marking entry into our noble profession of caring. And the white coat can be a symbol of well-deserved admiration, honor, and respect. It confers upon you a great deal of privilege, but also responsibility. So as you mature into your role as physician, remember to be humble and also to be of service. Hello, my name is Addie Agadaro. My name is Sasha Deutschlink, and I'm a first year medical student at Yale. Hey, my name is Richard Kim. I'm a first year medical student at Yale University. All right, I'm Matt Meislish. I'm from Weston, Connecticut. Uh, Jake Wister from Guilford, Connecticut, then Dallas, and now back here. I took two years off in between college and medical school and got to work in clinical research and was exposed to hospitals and got to meet a lot of doctors and um, after talking with a lot of doctors and seeing what they do on kind of a daily basis, I knew it was kind of the right path for me. Four years ago I was here living in that dorm um, as a participant in SMDP and I feel like that program helped solidify for me that medicine is what, not only what I wanted to do, but it was something that I could do. It kind of inspired and instilled in me the confidence to, to go for it. And it, just learning more about the Yale system, I, I just fell in love with it. And I knew freshman year, this is where I wanted to be and what I wanted to do. I entered college thinking that I wanted to save the world, but I fell in love with Chinese literature. Um, and I ended up going to China, but as fate would have it, I ended up working for a nonprofit with migrant workers, and um, some conversations with uh, some of the children that I worked with um, really helped me see medicine as a language in itself. Just as I was learning Chinese characters, I felt that learning medicine as a language could really be a powerful way to engage with people. I thought that medicine might be the path for me for a long time, um, but I didn't decide until maybe a year ago when I started applying. I was a history major in college, but I was taking science classes alongside that and doing some lab work and trying to figure out if medicine and science was right for me. And, um, and I studied history and philosophy of science for a year uh, in England. And um, along the way, I figured out that as a career, as a profession, medicine and, and, and along with biomedical research is probably the only thing I could really see myself doing. I hope to, um, through working in medicine, I hope to be able to address some of the inequality and health disparities that I saw when I was growing up in, in my neighborhood and, and in New York City. Um, and I also hope to, I guess, I really like research and kind of figuring out solutions to problems and, and kind of exploring new ideas. And so I hope to be working in some sort of academic setting as well. I feel like it changes every day. Ask me four years ago, I would have been a pediatrician. Now I'm interested in being an ob -GYN and it's probably gonna change, but um, I'm just open to the new possibilities and can't wait to see what lies ahead. I mean, in general, I know that I'm interested in neuroscience, um, but that, can, that kind of touches on everything. So um, at the moment, I don't know where that'll lead. The, the lab I've been working in is, uh, we, we study schizophrenia, and I've kind of been really fascinated by that since my years in college and thinking about it from a philosophical perspective. So, you know, whatever I do, it's, it's kind of, uh, you know, combining the, the science and the, the basic biology with the, uh, <laughs> with the high-minded uh, high uh, philosophical perspective. So but that's one way or another, it'll be something like that. That's sort of, I mean, it seems like that's something Yale values. I mean, the more we talk to our fellow classmates yeah. like today, everybody has sort of an interesting story. Like, their interests are sort of all over the map. Um, and I think that they, Yale actually puts an emphasis on that, which makes it a really fun group of people to be around.